just got holes in it on the side of the house here. Gary Dancy shows us the damage. Several cracks on his property, on his street, and on the sidewalk. Most of the cracks, after you have the sidewalks redone, will crack back up again. Residents near Baldwin Hills blame a process called hydraulic fracturing, or fracking, taking place in this nearby oil field. That's when chemical-laced water is injected in the ground to extract oil and natural gas. Environmentalists worry the practice could be polluting groundwater and might even cause earthquakes. City leaders say mysterious cracks like this could be proof. Property damage where soil is sinking, foundations are cracking, house, houses are being destroyed. At the same time, uh, the oil companies are saying they don't know why that's occurring. LA City Council member Bernard Parks points to one recent study showing fracking does not cause pollution or earthquakes. Then again, that study was funded by an oil company, PXP. Parks and the LA City Council want more objective studies. They also say a state bill that would regulate fracking in California isn't strong enough. The council wants more local control. Currently in California, there are no rules requiring oil companies to disclose where they use the procedure, also what chemicals they inject into the ground. L.A. City leaders expect a tough legal fight ahead of them to change the rules in the city of Los Angeles, a fight that could take years. Meantime, council members Paul Koretz and Mike Bonin have introduced a motion calling for a moratorium on fracking until more safety tests are conducted. Joining them, actors Ed Begley Jr. and S.I. Morales. If a group of people poisoned millions of gallons of California's water while no one was looking, we would label it terrorism and call in the troops. And yet that's what's happening with fracking right now in California. They point to a U.S. geological survey showing that fracking has caused earthquakes in Ohio, Texas, and other states. This is very uh, concerning. Uh, because they weren't necessarily states that are prone to earthquakes. Uh, so this practice in, in a city and a state that's very prone to earthquakes uh, could absolutely be deadly. Not to mention an eyesore for people near Baldwin Hills. Gil Reyes for LA This Week.